Hi there, this is Jeff from jeffmobile.com. I'm here today to share with you a sound that I created for my Roland Gaia SH-01 synthesizer. This is, behind me is my synthesizer. I'm gonna be playing it in just a second to demonstrate the sound. But this sound makes the synthesizer sound more like a classic instrument, classic keyboard from maybe the 80s or 70s. It's, it's a Wurlitzer-like sound. If you ever heard of a Wurlitzer keyboard, they're kind of rare nowadays, but I really like the sound. They're really smooth. They're in a similar kind of category of instrument as the Rhodes keyboard, although not as common. Many great recordings have used the Wurlitzer keyboard, and you can still find them in some schools. They have them uh, in the classrooms. But uh, I wanted to share with you this sound because I think if you were playing your synthesizer, the Roland Gaia, in a more of a pop music context or with other people, like say a guitarist or a singer, I find that the Wurlitzer sound that I've created is quite useful as a starting point to access a lot of sounds that make the, make the Roland Gaia sound more like an acoustic or traditional style keyboard useful for blending with other instruments. So let me first of all play a few notes on using the Wurlitzer sound and I'll let you sort of explore and hear what it sounds like. Here it goes. All right, so those were some chords from a friend of mine's song. He wrote that song. It's called Another Lover. His name is Gio Levy. So I was just playing some of the chords from his beautiful song on the Roland Gaia. So now I'm going to take you on a little tour of this sound so you can try to recreate it yourself. I'm going to go into the Roland Gaia tool on the PC and show you what these patches are. And at the end of this video, I'll also provide a link below where you can download this patch and load it into your Gaia tool and load it onto your Gaia via the Gaia tool. So yeah, if you wanted to try this sound out on your own Gaia, I'll give you the sound for free so you can enjoy making some beautiful, classic, Wurlitzer sounding music with it. So with that, I'll uh, close this video off with a short tour of the Roland Gaia tool. All right, so this synthesizer patch in the Roland Gaia tool is using a single tone called the Tone 1. It has a triangle wave with variation A, so it's the basic, basic triangle wave. And it's got no oscillators, um, detuning or pitch changes. The modulation depth for pulse width is this, is zero. There's no envelope attack time or decay or depth on the pitch. For the filter, we have a low pass filter. The filter scope is the minus 24 dB setting, which is a variation on the filter. I've set the cutoff at around 75 and the key follow is at 50. I've got the envelope velocity sensor, uh, 21, and resonance at 36. The resonance gives it the extra quality of the Rolitzer. And decay time on the filter, actually I'm not using, actually using a bit of filter depth there, a bit of filter depth, and the amp level, you can see there, 
using a little bit of LFO to modulate the pitch a little bit, very small amount. And yeah, so that's pretty much it. The modulation LFO, not using that right now. So yeah, just a single tone on the Roland Gaia. Roland Gaia is an amazing instrument, so I hope that you'll enjoy the patch. I'll provide the link below this video. Thanks a lot for watching, and hope you have a great day. Talk to you later. Bye.